For a long time, there had been a rumor that the real reason Lindsay Crisley left Crisley Knows Best was because her father's new wife Julie assaulted her. Now, the estrangement caused Lindy to be the black sheep of the family. For the most part, fans of the reality TV family divided and picked a side. Because Todd was on television still and in a much brighter spotlight than his daughter, most people sided with him and his version of the stories. Sadly, court documents from Todd and Julie's recent convicting and sentencing confirm Lindsay's version of the story was very much the truth. Julie Crisley assaulted her stepdaughter Lindsay in front of a bunch of witnesses. Per the court documents, she reportedly assaulted Lindsay in front of a production crew. And, the incident also happened in front of Todd. How did Julie Crisley manage to assault Lindsay in front of a bunch of witnesses and get away with it? Why didn't Lindsay press charges against her stepmother? The court documents tell the full story. Keep reading for a summary of the court documents. Julie Crisley once assaulted Lindsay. Per sentencing exhibit number 14, on pages 2 and 3, Fans learn that 2017 was the year that Lindsay Crisley, then referred to as Lindsay Campbell, stopped filming Crisley Knows Best. According to Lindsay, she believed her last day filming, or the day behind, was when the IRS seized a storage unit belonging to her father Todd. Lindsay speculates her stepmother Julie was likely upset about the storage unit the day she assaulted her. According to the court documents, Julie became upset at Lindsay Crisley for reading Chloe a bedtime story. Julie Crisley reportedly invaded Lindsay's space, got in her face, grabbed her neck, and slapped her. Per the documents, Lindsay Crisley was slapped by Julie in front of a filming crew and her father Todd. Embarrassed by what happened, Lindsay informed her father she could have Julie arrested for assaulting her before leaving. Lindsay Crisley later had an anxiety attack over what happened. Why didn't Lindsay Crisley send her stepmother to jail? The biggest question fans have is simple, if this really happened, why didn't Lindsay press charges against Julie Crisley? Turns out, she did not file a police report. Instead, she hired an attorney to handle the situation. Lindsay later learned Todd, and the media company, also hired an attorney. Furthermore, they hired an investigator. Julie Crisley reportedly flipped the story when recalling it to the investigator claiming that Lindsay was the aggressor in the situation. Making things worse, everyone who saw the incident was forced to sign a non-disclosure agreement. Sadly, Lindsay Crisley's attorney informed her that filing a lawsuit was a waste of time because everyone would support Julie's version of the story out of fear of losing their job. Fans of the family react in disgust. These few pages of court documents were discussed in great detail on Reddit. Overall, fans were disgusted with how Todd and Julie treated Lindsay. Moreover, Fans were flabbergasted by the fact that Lindsay has somehow forgiven her parents and let them back into her life. Some fans speculate Todd likely threatened Lindsay, again, to play nice because of the ongoing legal battle.